First of all, uh, I want for all Missourians to know our thoughts and prayers are with the families and the victims uh, in this tragic event that's occurred down here. Uh, needless to say, it's uh, the things that have occurred in the last 24 hours uh, are heartfelt. It's a sad occasion, a lot of people involved, a lot of families involved with us down here on vacation trying to enjoy time and ends up with uh, an incident like this. There's a multiple agencies have come together to try to help with this tragic event to bring some sort of conclusion to it. Uh, needless to say, uh, again, myself and the First Lady, our thoughts and prayers right now are with these family members uh, that are here, uh, going to have to deal with this tragedy. We as a state will do everything within my powers to make sure that they all have the resources here they need to come to a conclusion on this incident and to finish with the investigation of this tragedy, that we know what the outcome of it was and, and what those results will be. I think it's going to take time to know the details of everything that's occurred. The sheriff, the, the highway patrol, a lot of people involved trying to answer all the questions that you're asking this morning. It's going to take some time to really be able to answer those questions on that. We don't know what the status of all the events yet. That's still under investigation. Until that investigation is completed, I don't think it's my place or anyone's place to speculate all the things that could have happened or why they happened. I think it's important that we find out for sure exactly what events did occur and, and then be able to release that at some point. And that will happen eventually, but today it's just still early. Uh, and the sheriff and his people and all the people behind me that's been working, you know, they've been up on this thing for a long time. And it's just a matter of bringing all these details together. At a point, that will happen.